How many of you have watched, or heck, how many of you knew about the Big 12's Fast Channel being launched, as in it is available for everyone to watch, everyone who has the Roku channel or a few other streaming platforms? Have, have you watched any other content provided by Big 12 Inside Studios, Inside the Big 12? I didn't know it had officially launched until a few days ago. I knew it was scheduled to be launched, but I did not know it had been officially launched until I got word from Big 12. And I checked it out. More is coming soon. For the most part, it is broadcast reruns of football games of the participating Big 12 schools. And then every so often they sprinkle in a highlight show, a weekly highlight show. And then they have an inside the Big 12 show, a weekly inside the Big 12 show. That's it. That's the content. Football games, repeat football games on loop, highlight show, and then an inside the Big 12 show. I know it's early in the launch of the show and but gee, that's all y'all got. <laughs> that's all y'all have. Really? That's it. That's all y'all have. Mm. But yes, I, I, I'm watching it or I didn't well, I saw like 10 minutes of it and then I scroll through the, the uh, TV guide and trying to look at the schedule. So that's about it. I saw it. I saw it on the, uh, the Roku channel. So yes, it is on the Roku channel, Big 12, Inside the Studios. It's on Roku and Amazon. I'm checking my text message from someone who works at the Big 12. All right, see, I see, I see the comment from Rex. Rex didn't know that the Big 12 Fast Channel launched. I want to say this. The person who told me that the person who responded to my text that it launched, <laughs> I, 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 oh, I think I was at the Coos game on Monday. And when I got the response, I wanted to say, it did? <laughs> really? That's a fail. Come on, Big 12. In the initial press release, it stated that the Fast Channel would launch in the fall. I want to. I want to say that was right around what September twenty something. Okay, at the time of it, that was the press release. It had not launched. We talked about it here on the show. D Skills has some comments about it. I think Rex did too. But between then and now, I had no idea that it was on Roku and Amazon. That's a fail. I get the press releases from the conference about all sports. I thought. <laughs> That's a fail. And y'all know I love basketball. I know football makes college sports go round. I know that. But damn, let people know, let your fans know about your new outlet for them to consume content. Let the media know to let fans know about this new way to consume content. And hell, I, I hope come basketball season, that's now here, they have something in store, something in mind to have more content than, than what they have right now on the channel. Like I said, it's all football games, repeats, rebroadcasts, a week, weekly highlight show. In, in two, 21st century, you're doing a weekly highlight show? Y'all can't do an, a daily show? Hire me. I, we can do a daily show. Me and John Kurtz in Kansas, we can do a daily show. Gone. It should not be that difficult. A weekly show for a power four conference. That does not make sense. That does not make sense to me. Got to do better, especially if you continue to claim and beat that drum that you have the best 
college basketball, men's college basketball in the country. Come on. Do better. <laughs>